when he's shooting worst of your five, it's a pretty good starting <laughs> five for Chris Mack in Louisville. Cardinals in white, Spartans in green, and we are underway. Already only four seconds on the shot clock. Have to hurry. Over to Bruner for a three. And he hits it. That's a one way to get started. And a man defense for USC Upstate. And that gives Louisville a huge edge, at least on paper. And that's the opening score for the ACC preseason player of the year, Wara. Defense went to Sutton, and Wara with a nice cut through the lane. Really good pass. Another triple, and it knocks down Dalvin White that time. Two shots, two threes. And Eddie Fear against the number two team in the country. Wara again, showing off a mid-range game, and he knocks it down. They have not been able to take advantage of a clear size advantage they have. It fearless the other way. That's Tommy Bruner, the freshman again. Well off the mark. Great hustle. Perry pushes the tempo immediately. Here's Wara skying and slamming. Trying to stay hot. Offensive rebound bobbled around. Sutton emerges. Kick down McMahon. He's got it. Been on fire to start this year. When Perry pointing at his guys, telling him, go. McMahon tries another and buries him. Ryan McMahon back to back threes. Ryan McMahon's got back-to-back -back threes for this Cardinals team. A oh, great wow. feed, and Dwayne Sutton pays it off. They've been in the Big South, so again, they have 14 players that are freshmen or sophomores. That, another great feed from McMahon. Wow, he is really doing it all in this first half. And these fans expect a number two next to the name of Louisville. It's just been a while since they've actually had it. Jordan Wara rocks the rim again. Into two run. Let's take another look at this dunk, Dan. Taking highly contested shots at the end of the shot clock, and recently they're giving up layups on the other end. Wara picks the pocket. Kimball gives it right back to him. And back-to-back -back baskets for Jordan Wara. Helping one another, talking to one another on defense. Much needed three. That ends a huge drought. It had been more than two and a half minutes since Upstate. But their game is not built on three-point shooting, so you make your first couple of threes of the game, that's a little bit of fool's gold. There's the freshman, Sam Williams. He has all the tools to be a spectacular player. It's been a relentless defense from Louisville, but that time, he fast break points so far tonight. But Booker's come into this game, that's his second make, and don't look now. Now, a lot of their shooting is based on movement, and one of the reasons you play a zone is to disrupt the movement. McMahon, and somehow the iron so kind it ends up going down. Well, he's more than a catch-and-shoot guy there. He pumped fake, got the defender out of the way, took his time, and knocked it down. Has a couple of nice passes tonight, too, but there's your answer the other way. Bryson Mazone. Offensive rebound gives the Spartans another chance. Mozone nails it! Bryson Mozone makes this a one possession game. He didn't get the rebound, but he created the opportunity for Aldridge to get the rebound, and the result is a three. Inside to Enoch, that's his game. This, this, this type of game gives him an opportunity to knock some of the rust off. That and time it bounced right around him, couldn't scoop it up, but it leads to an upstate bucket with Nevin Zink inside. That looked like the number team, two team in the country should in this first half. Wara three. He buries it. That's more like it. Time and time again. Inside to Wara. Keeps it alive. Misses the layup and taps it in. And the shooting has not been at their standard. But the defense has bailed him out. A deep three. And it falls for Upstate. That's kind of been the story of this first half. Shot clock winding down. Huge height advantage with Stephen Enoch, but the ball was knocked loose. He has got three Mozo, and he knocks it down. Back-to-back -back threes if you go back to the final shot of the first half for Bryson Mozo. Great passing, though. Open three, White can't knock it down. Wara in transition. Keeps it himself all the way, coast to coast, Jordan Wara. Here's Perry, goes inside to Enoch, like they've done on every possession in the second half, and this time, Steven Enoch 
capitalizes. Ten seconds to shoot. Trying to tie this game at 40, and they do. Everett Hammond drills the three. Upstate doing a nice job getting in transition. Up the court very quickly. Scoop to the hoop. Everett Hammond and the Spartans jump in front. They can get set. Why do you think they're struggling against the set defense? Well, they're not shooting the ball well. Dwayne Sutton buries that one. They're there when they need it most. Mozone, great feed. Blocked at the rim. Steven Enoch, a rejection. Three big man. He drills it. They might punch back all night long. Louisville 8-0 run. Let's see what the Spartans have. Open three. And uh, there's, the, there's that punch back. I thought they were in a little bit of a danger zone. Aldrich, one of their better three-point shooters. Right back to a two-point game. McMahon, a three. He's got five triples tonight. Perry tries a three. He's got it. Wow. Is Can you win a game when you don't play well? And right now leading by ten. How about that? Just into the game for Dave Dickerson. Wow, this is a set play where he just goes off the screen of Enoch and that was Bruner who just lost him out there. And they talk about this kid's... Louisville picks his pocket. Williamson with the mush. Scoop and score for the Cardinals who now lead by 14, their largest lead of the night. Mozone, tough finish, muscling his way inside for two. He's made a couple of baskets. This is a team that has some potential. Remember, they're very young. Jordan Wara rocks the rim. He's up to 23. I see Upstate had a lot of success early in the half, was forcing turnovers. Great pass. And the finish there, Malik Williams into the scoring column with his first basket of the season. Absolutely the correct call. Jahan, his first touch of the game, and he slams it home. For Jordan Wara with 28. Well, now this is, you get a screen. Pulse. And he can throw it down. That's one thing he can do. Well, he would be, a, look at that body. He would be a Hulk in any national. In large part to the Cardinals. Oh, what he play. also plays like that. Wara somehow keeps it alive. Throws oh, it up, oh. and it goes down. Jordan Wara. To 25. Right. For 30 minutes, this was a back and forth game, but it has been all Cardinals down the stretch, and Wara adds three more. Up to Johnson for another rack attack. Well, it was not pretty, but Louisville ends this game on a 16-2 run to make it a comfortable win.